635. Let's check your long range forecast with Russ. And we got some clouds moving into the backdrop behind me here as well. And they are actually, uh, you know, featured in the forecast quite prominently here for day one. This weather report brought to you by Cowell Volkswagen. Now, I say cloudy, but not necessarily wet. I actually suspect the south coast will remain completely dry today. I see a few sprinkles in the Doppler radar. They're not really uh, of import. I think it'll be completely cloudy and stay dry today. The rain is closing in on the west coast of the island. That rounds the bend and shows up sometime after dinner. So, yes, probably turning wet ahead of schedule for the southern part of the island. Maybe some of the neighboring mountains here get a bit of extra development from that uh, that southwest wind. South of the border, I don't think the rain gets there just yet. So we're starting out overcast into Fino and Nanaimo and Victoria, but the rain hung up over the northern end of the island only right now. It comes ashore a little later this afternoon. Victoria with a chance of showers under a predominantly gray sky and a high of just 18 degrees. So some light showers later this afternoon, definitely trending much wetter into the evening and overnight time frame. For Worcester, well, it looks similar, but those showers, well, they'll be really like sprinkles getting there sometime during the afternoon. Only 19 degrees, mostly cloudy in Cedar Sky today. Uh, your summer sizzle shows up a little bit further down the path. I'm thinking, you know, maybe Saturday, Sunday, Monday. That's when it'll get closer to 30 degrees by early next week. But a long ways to go before we get to 30. 19 today, clouds and a few sprinkles. South of the border, no rain. And in fact, a little leftover sun peeking through some of those clouds. 22 degrees in Seattle. We're going to settle for an even 20 around these parts with mostly gray skies next to no showers at all today. But tonight it rains. Tomorrow looks cool and wet. 17 degrees showers, maybe a thunderstorm as well. Uh, even Friday unsettled for the first half of the day. So if you're looking for that sun, set your sights on Friday afternoon and you're almost good to go throughout the entire weekend. It warms up. It trends sunnier. There then are those summertime temperatures in next week's outlook in the mid to upper 20s. Now, Thor, I don't suspect we have any weather related hazards.